So, uh, Salfo PMS are the branches of the external carotid artery. Okay, so the carotid artery comes up and then it splits, and the internal carotid artery goes off. And name all the branches of the internal carotid artery. None. Right, there aren't any. There are no carotid, no branches of the internal carotid artery. So at that bifurcation, now we start talking about all the stuff that branches off this external carotid artery. And the first one turns around and goes right back down to the thyroid, and that's going to be the superior thyroidal artery, right? Superior thyroid artery. The next one, ex uh, accessory, is going to end up um, going. Accessory pharyngeal? Sorry, accessory pharyngeal. Ends up going up and actually turns medial and goes kind of into the board. If this is my left one, it would go in and go over to my esophagus. Okay? Ascending pharyngeal. The next one is the lingual artery. Okay? The next one that comes off is the facial, and it actually goes up and curves over the top of the face, and it always runs with the hypoglossal nerve. Okay? They're always running together. The next one is the occipital, running the other way, running off across the back of the head. Okay. The next one is the posterior auricular, so it's right behind your little ear hole there. Okay, running around the back of the ear. M is the big one. This one actually is so big, I could do another thing on that, and that's the maxillary. And it's got like you know the first branch is going to be the. It, middle meningeal artery coming off, and then you have a couple of deep temporals, you have uh, the, the uh, mandibular branch coming down like that, and this ends up, ends up going right into the uh, fossa, right into the back of the maxilla. What's left over at the top here is the superficial temporal artery. Okay, now some people think that, that say that the superficial temporal artery is the end, other people say that the superficial temporal artery has the transverse facial coming off of it. Other people say it's its own, uh, own artery, so that depends on what book you read and who said that. But these are branches of the external carotid artery. And that's why they're so easy to find when I want, people are like, well, we can't find the maxillary, I can't find the posterior auricular. I go from the maxillary and start backtracking down here until I can find the next one that comes off that should be going off to the, next, uh, posterior, the posterior auricular. Questions on that? Sounds good. Thank the you. next one.